zebra painting this is our next project for all of us to try it's from the photo by Frida Bredsen I downloaded it from the free photo website so we are okay to use it it's uh, so yet again I mark a square 21 by 21 centimeters and uh, so it's just easier with the proportions and I just want to keep all the paintings I'm doing in the same size so just I don't have like 20 different sizes so I'm starting here with with a sketch I actually sketch with um, 4b pencil rather than 2b so you can see the lines better but just overall proportions first you know mark where the ears go and the outline of the body and then just you know it just takes forever I found it really difficult just put all those stripes in and I made few mistakes but I made sure those mistakes weren't that important so um I'm just gonna keep this as the same speed and come back to you when I finish this. So here I started adding a bit of wash and maybe this this thing is maybe not um, as easy to, to maybe spot because of the zebra is, is, is black and white but I just try to describe form so obviously underneath um, the head there will be more shadow and I tried to pick it up although I have to say it was really hard so all this painting is painted with just one paint, paints grey and I just use a wash of it okay so before this dried out i started um painting in the in the few areas that didn't have water on like the eye and then a few stripes and then i dried it out and continue just painting the paint and it's just as easy as it, as it sounds just basically painting each stripe one by one and taking taking time to do it and um, I'll, I'll, I'll talk to you more when I when I finish with the stripes.
So here I'm touching the surf surface and I'm just deciding to dry out. Um, so I cut it out so you don't see me, me drying the painting, but the surface is dry now. And I just go one by one. I'm going to speed it up so it's um, just more, maybe not as boring to watch. So here I started uh, the nostril and the mouth of the zebra. So I basically applied um, the, the color I'm using, which is paint gray, and I applied it first, being just very careful. And then I removed it with a little bit of water. Okay, so whatever I saw lighter uh, color, I just removed it with a brush. So the reason for that is just to keep it soft. So you can see now I'm removing with just wet brush some of the moisture and I'm just dapping in a tissue in between okay after I've done this I added another darker uh, element to it so you can see it now with more concentrated paint this is all still when it's wet so just so it made it easy to sort of spread out Just adding a few details here and there, just some missing stripes, but basically the, the painting is, is, is finished. I was contemplating about adding the little um, whiskers uh, or hair around the mouth in white, but then I decided against it. So after I dried it, I, I um, used a razor to erase all the lines. There's loads of showing through and because it's black and white, I just didn't want to see them. So basically that's it, painting's finished. It all took 25 minutes.